Hello. I will now show you how to install a domain controller and a DHCP server. First, you need to open server management and you click management, add role and features. Next, you select configuring a single server by adding rules. Select the server from the server pool. Yes, it is our server. Digital zone, server. Next. And you select Active Directory Domain Services. And you should add future. Next. And it is OK. We have it. Next. Next and install and it can take some time but yes and now we need to set up an IP address for the server Ethernet properties version 6 don't need version 6 use the following IP address we gave this, this IP address oh. uh, there yes Add a domain controller to a domain. No. Add a new forest. Yes. Domain root. A digital zone. Zone. DK. Uh, next. Waiting. Remember what server to the child. Oh, yes, domain name server system. Yes, yes. Password. Yeah. We use the server password, so we don't forget it. Next. And next. Mm. And we're waiting. Next. Next. Bezeria. Next. We are ready to install. Install. And now we are now on the we should now on the domain controller. Other users. The domain was the E K E T A L. Set on it. Okay. Backlash. Password and we log in. Playing user settings.
and now we can add now we can add the DHCP server manager add rule in future next same as last time next our server next DHCP server here add future next and it's okay next and uh, next and install yes and we should close local server start mm. what DNS Active Directory in the computers DSP and let's create a scope version 4 new scope scope name mm. digital description world say that and now we should tell the DSP server what IP address it must use to, to give to the client our server here have the have the IP 17 lost uh, lost so we'll take the 18 and we'll take the IP yes At the end IP address mask and we say next 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 yes next digital zone just the server yes correct the next is I want to actually with the scope now is I want it want it to work yes we have the address. Uh, oh. Yes, address pool. From there to there. Twelve IP addresses to use. And now we need the client to get the IP address. So we need to complete DHCP server. As you can see, complete configuration. Next, yes, we use one strata, commit, and yes, and close. It's fine. Completed. And. Um, And now we need to go to um, to the network. Something in happen with Dennis. Yes, we should start control panel network change Ethernet properties. Check it out. Yes, the local. DNS it doesn't work when it's local. Must be the IP address. Close. Yes, yes. What about if the client doesn't show up here? We maybe need to restart the client. We have the client here. here and we select the uh, yes, work fine and we will have the, in the domain first we will see the IP address uh, what IP address it has yes mm, domain digit 
tall. So, okay, yes. Mm -hmm. Password. The administrator content to the server. Okay. Yes, okay, okay, close, reboot, and we can see it here, yes, come into the main, I'm gonna add a fill out, oh, refresh, all the clients on the network, will show up here and if we go to the hmm now we try to make a user <laughs> to the domain Uses. User. Yeah, we call it digital. Mm, yes. Sound. Was that what? Ah, it's not strong enough. For the options for VMware, as I use the network's options, is look like this VM net zero auto breaching. The same here on the client. No, no. But uh, thanks for watching.